Okay. Hi, I'm Joa Posey, and I'm here with... Jason Bothe. Okay, so you have some lovely shoes behind us and on your feet. And uh, I am very intrigued by these. You guys were just saying you're in, like, swim shorts right now. Yeah. So you, so you just were swimming. I was... Uh, well, well, walking around in water with your shoes yeah, on? Yeah, I was walking around in water, jumped off some lava cliffs uh, out in Maui. <laughs> I uh, was in Palm Springs. And are you serious or are you pulling my leg? No, well, actually it was Cuba, sorry. Oh, wasn't, okay. Yeah, Cuba, Palm Springs, and then Berlin. It gets hot in Berlin. Yeah, okay, so tell me a little bit about this company. Uh, Native Shoes was uh, based in 2009 out of Vancouver, Canada. We are uh, EVA injected uh, footwear, which is very lightweight. Um, our owner uh, or founder was intrigued by by a shoe that Nike made called the Mayfly, which was a running shoe that was basically made to, to run a marathon and then to be thrown away. So it was basically the lightest weight shoe that had ever been made. So he was really intrigued with the material and, and learning about the material he found out is called EVA, which is was an injected foam. So there's another foam EVA product on the market, uh -huh. which are very ugly. <laughs> or what? So you guys and it, and it, and it, fashionable No, so he, he, he was like, why can't we make a cool shoe out of this material that doesn't you know, look like an alligator. Got it. Okay. Yeah. So he created these, and they are fun. They definitely, like, so unlike the running shoes, we don't have to discard them after one race. No, right? we don't have oh, to discard good. them. You can, I was you worried. Can, I was like, oh, we're just going to have to chuck them? You can, no, no, no. You, okay. can, you, can, you, can, you can definitely keep them. But, but that was the, the inspiration was light, the, a really lightweight shoe that's right. fun, uh, casual silhouettes. The first three silhouettes were, were a Vans era, um, a Chuck Taylor and uh, Clark's Wallaby. That was our inspiration, which we thought was, was the three iconic shoes, shoes of our time. Yeah. Fantastic. So you're gifting these to the athletes today? We are gifting them to the athletes and then, uh, you know, maybe possibly hosts and camera girls. Hey, you know, that's totally okay. You know? So what's your favorite color out of all of them? Because they're bright colors and they're fun. My favorite color is... And shoe style, because you know and they're slightly style? different. I like I like the Vans. The, okay. the, it's called the Miller, and I like it in. The, we have a black, all black, uh -huh. so very black stylish. sole. Yeah, very. You can wear it with anything, and uh, you know, very casual. And this, is, uh, this is called a, a Fit Simmons, and it's basically we 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 took a, a almost like a Timberland hiker and made it out of EVA. It's a two-piece EVA construction with a neoprene inliner. Yeah. And then, of course, this is our first shoe that we incorporated the lace technology. And these, uh, these sold extremely, extremely well in Tokyo and London. And uh, we got a lot of, a lot of uh, blog presence on, like, Hype Beast and High Snobiety. And, it, you know, this, is, this has been our number one selling shoe so far. Um, we also do kids. kids. They're so kids cute. Kids in, in the three classic styles. This is the Miller, the Corrado, and the Jefferson. And these are doing extremely well. We just had a picture of uh, Haley Berry's kid coming out of preschool, rocking some of our shoes. Oh, adorable. Awesome. We have a new... This big boot. A new model. It's, it's basically a, a duck boot, which is, I think, made famous by L.L. Bean. And so we did... <laughs> we did we, and we'd, I don't mind naming other brands that inspire us. So this was... Um, Similar style. This is our first time we used two piece, two piece uh, like fabric. We right. we what like a this is, it's like a, a, a non non rip nylon with like a microfiber inliner, and then of course the laces and uh, the two piece construction sole. And we have a uh, I don't know if I can say this, but we have a collaboration with Marc Jacobs coming out next year. And it's going to be pretty amazing. So. A lot of it is obviously we wanted to make a light shoe, but we also wanted to be a fashion brand and not so much just, you know, for our kids right. kind of thing. So, so we're, we're looking at different styles and, and classic silhouettes. And, uh, yeah, there's a lot lot more new styles that, to come. This is a new <laughs> flocking uh, uh, situation that we did. So we are able to, like, put this in and, and, and make it almost like a felt yeah. with, you know, obviously the same inside, but with, like, a flocking on the outside. And this will be new for spring 11. Fun. Yes. Great. Seems like you got good things on the horizon. Things are going really good. Great. Yeah. That's fantastic. Great. Thank so you. if we want to keep up with you online, where should we go? Nativeshoes.com. Perfect. And Twitter at Native Shoes, Facebook, Facebook Native Shoes, Friend well, Friendster. <laughs> we don't have one. <laughs> I was about to say Friendster. <laughs> that was a while ago, but you know, whatever. <laughs>
Perfect. Thanks. Thank you so much. Yeah.